Hello everyone, this is William from Allegory Gallery and we're very excited. We're back this week with an Around the Town video and even more exciting, we are at Fort Ligonier. So we are going to go through the fort and we are going to go in and talk to Michelle in the Fort Ligonier Museum store. So we're gonna show you a little bit about the store today and maybe, maybe someday we'll get in here and get a full viewing of the entire fort but we really want to focus on the store because you don't need to pay admission to get into the store and they have lots of great things um, reproduction, reproduction time period pieces um, games for kids without batteries it's amazing so what we're gonna do is I'm gonna take you in and we're gonna talk to Michelle and she's gonna take us through the store so let's go ahead flip the camera around and so you can see where you're going and how to get there, how to get there. So we're in the parking lot here, and I parked way up there, which is nice. They have extended parking. And we're going to go in right here through the museum entrance. This is the information outpost here at the fort. Nice reception area, echoing in here. And we're gonna go in and say hi to a few people in here. Hello. Hello, this is Sam. And let's head in through here. So we go around here and you start to see the store here. And we have like a fine landsman, madam. It is Michelle. And look who it is. We have George Washington here today. Oh, Hello, Michelle. How are you today? Good. How are you? Good. Colonel Washington is doing some shopping in our gift shop. Today. Nice. It's very necessary that I have a lantern on my ride back to Mount Vernon. If, if you're leaving tonight at night, you will need. Yes, after sunset, I'm going to need a lantern, or I might have to stay at an inn, which I don't know about the inns around this area. But I'm no, sure they're wonderful. They are lovely. Well, maybe I might stay, so I don't know. All right, Colonel. Well, let me show you around, because you will need a candle for your own. Oh, yes, very nice. A candle would be very appropriate. Let's follow along with them here today. Oh, perhaps do we have bayberry? I smell. I do enjoy a nice smell. We have a large variety of candles, oh. including bayberry. Oh, yes, madam, if I may. Yes, you oh, may. Right. Pardon me for not taking off my, my hat here. Excuse me. No. Terrible manners. I, I got right. so <laughs> entwined with that lantern. So let's oh. talk about these candles yes. a little bit. So we carry uh, bayberry, the true bayberry. It's uh, made from the actual shrub. So it's not anything artificial. We have all natural yes. beeswax candles. And these we carry beautiful. a variety of sweet candles as well. Oh my, look at some of the, oh, is that leather? How yes. did you put leather into a candle, madam? This is a, is this some I type of? Leather pipe and wood. I think wood. our yeah. viewers would like to know that too. Oh my, this is wonderful. So have you got it's, this from a sutler, I believe? A sutler in Pennsylvania. So oh. a lot of, we try and get as much local as we can, or at least uh, in the USA. Well, of course. Um, we try and support local artisans as well. A bread of zucchini. Yes, we have a zucchini bread candle. Bayberry, of course. Oh, and are these jams, madam? Perhaps preserves of sorts? We carry a wide variety of jams, jellies, and even a honey mustard pretzel dip. A honey mustard pretzel? I'm not sure if I'm familiar with it. I think you would enjoy it. It's oh. sweet and savory. Sweet and savory, of yes. course. No. Now, Fine along China. those lines, we also carry cookie mixes um, with a lovely Port Ligonier logo on them. Oh, my, is that nice. cake? Um, that is coffee Struzel. cake mix. Streusel. Apple cinnamon pancake mix. Look at these. I'm excited about these. These are absolutely yes. wonderful, madam. Lovely. Gingerbread mix, oatmeal raisins. Believe, you're quite nice. the baker, aren't you? You are. <laughs> sure, you are. Sure, but you know what? You don't have to be a serious baker for these. It's just add a couple of ingredients. Well, there you are. Grab and go. That's something, especially when I'm on campaign, if I need to create something very quickly, especially for the soldiers. Yes. Well, perhaps oh, I've lost my gorge day. Oh. I? If I drop that, that means no one's going to know I'm an officer. No one's going to know who's in charge. <laughs> don't want that to happen. <laughs> Need to know now, who's in charge here. After you've made cookies, we have teas to go with them for oh, a nice afternoon tea. Beautiful. So we have a wide selection of herbal teas as well as even colonial bohi tea. Now that is the tea that they drank back in colonial times. 
And it Washington has, knows something about yes, this, yes, I'm it sure. It has a smoky scent to oh, it. Yes, it's almost so. like a campfire. It's so very good tea, though. It is. It's very good very tea. Very good tea. Very good tea. And I've had several of these other flavors that you, you've sampled for me I'm before. sure you have had the cocoa tea, which oh. was your future bride's uh, You're tea. talking about Martha. Martha. Not this future, your... madam. Present. <laughs> well, she is my, she is my well, wife. All right. Well, I forgot the year. I apologize, it's sir. No, it's all right. <laughs> but we have a cocoa tea. Very which nice. Which is made from the uh, outer pod of the cocoa pod. Uh, the outer shell of the cocoa pod and that tea you steep it like you would any other tea in a tea ball and you and enjoy you, seeing my name on it and <laughs> you also if you add cream and sugar it's almost like hot chocolate but with not the fewer calories nice oh, yeah. so it's just the nice now i'm seeing some things over here too yes so we have stemless wine glasses Colonel, you might be interested on your trip on horseback back home. Is that a, a, you to can, keep alcohol and perhaps yes, a whiskey can, of some sort? Absolutely. You can carry your whiskey in our Fort Ligonier uh, flask. Very nice. Yes. For long trips when it gets cold. <laughs> and it does get cold here. Yes, it does, it does get, get cold. cold. It does get cold. We even have wine spices if you want a nice wa warm wine for the holidays. Very and nice. cider that's spices night. as well. Cider spices. Twelfth night. We is do a have. I, I sometimes try to journey up here. You have a celebration. Yes, here. in January, and it is a lovely celebration. Wonderful. Um, and we do have the cider and wine at that so time. So many items, even some from the. Uh, oh yes, the other, the, the woodworker, Mr. Stein. It yes, seems. one of our local uh, artisans, Matt Stein. Those are some of his uh, pieces. I love these. Yes, oh, they're man. lovely. And some and glass, glass. glassware we as well. Yes, hand-blown glass. Oh, a French fire, madam. I believe this is a British fort. <laughs> it is a British fort. <laughs> All right, I understand that they make beautiful, beautiful pieces, but we must remember who we are allied with. Yes, but it's good to support everyone. <laughs> Madam, you have a we much finer welcoming. heart. Oh, the, yes, of course. Welcoming. The rising Very tide, well. right? That's right. Oh, honey. Honey. Yes, who colonial love honey. honey. Colonial I was not calling honey. you honey. Excuse me, madam. I meant the actual honey. Apologies, Art. Oh. Martha may get upset. Uh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> and George, Colonel. Johnny Cake's my Johnny favorite. favorite. Actually, breakfast. I do greatly enjoy those. Very simple, but very sweet. Yes, it's like a corn pancake, basically. Oh, is what very it is. nice. And Colonel Washington's favorite breakfast food. I do. Food. I greatly enjoy that. You put butter and syrup, and Could you put are... Even you perhaps honey. Even for a half I was time. not calling you. Never mind. <laughs> <laughs> I apologize. This is a confusion sometimes. Now, I do have a question for our viewers, Sorry. our people. They are not local, so is it possible to ship things? Unfortunately, we do not have an online store yet. We are okay. working on it. Okay. Though. So, we are working on an online store. If they were to request from this video, can it be shipped out? Um, I'm sure we could work something sure. out. Sure. Yes. Great. Yes. And we could help you with that if you need to. Okay. Cool. By wagon. By wagon. We won't bring anything. It won't take wagon. too long, right? <laughs> <laughs> wagon, yeah. the, the fastest mode of transport, right? For the most part. <laughs> in bulk. In bulk. <laughs> we could do that. Nice. We could work it nice. out for your viewers, absolutely. Oh, yes. We have oh, some tin as well. Yeah, so these are tin reproductions. These are hand done. Also, they're reproductions of items that were excavated from Fort Ligonier. Oh, nice. Yes. I might need one of those, perhaps the canteen. The canteen for your mm -hmm. ride. For the, yes, yes, of course. Absolutely. It's very similar to what you held up for the alcohol. But much it larger. <laughs> much perhaps larger. Shall <laughs> 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 I put this at the desk, perhaps? Oh, that would be lovely. I will. See, I'm just trying to help you out. <laughs> Thank you. I appreciate that. And we have gift items for um, really anyone, men, women. We have jewelry for the ladies. Let's see. Our people love jewelry, of course. So, yeah, some of them, there were Scotsmen here. So we do okay. carry a lot of so I see um, some Highlander, of the... Celtic knots, mm -hmm. things like that. We have Scottish tea. Ah, uh, yes, so the Highlanders. A, and here are earrings as well. A tough and sturdy group. Yeah, I imagine of so. Of course, here yeah. with General Forbes, yes, very much so. Archibald Montgomery as well. Hmm. I'm sure he would... He would greatly enjoy to see this. Oh, well, no, I haven't so seen good. him in quite some time. Oh, what else do we have? Well, also, oh. we have a large variety of books here, as well as um, small books on building smoke houses. I don't get to do this very often. <laughs> <laughs> I just figured it was slightly hot. 
It was. Those fans are very popular. You never know. Very nice. Summer day. <laughs> if I'm blushing whenever I'm out there. You're very demure, <laughs> right? <laughs> We have, um, so, so yes, yeah, so there are books on um, how-tos and well as colonial music. Ah, oh, the minstrels and the musicians, nice. of course. Uh, now, in keeping some with our books, well. we have, cool. these are um, fiction books, but they're historic fiction. So, okay. Um, but a lot of our books are non-fiction, mm -hmm. and we have a variety of children's books. Nice. George Washington's Rules to Live By for the Kids is very popular. It's very was... interesting. I have not seen this one. <laughs> I know you are into your manners, sir. I am, and apparently someone else is. Who's writing? <laughs> Hi. And if the kids, you know, books are always good to get, but we carry a large range of toys for the kids. Nothing I was telling our viewers, no batteries no in batteries these, required. right? batteries required, absolutely. Unless so. you mean an artillery battery. <laughs> <laughs> Which is in the fortification, cannons and how it's for children. If we give those to children, I have a bad feeling about them. Yes. So we have balls and cups. These are actually made by a local artist as well. Okay. I believe this is a spinner, madam. Of it so is. I am not good at it, it sir. Flies it's into, a flying machine. It's almost as if a bird would. So is it? Oh. Oh. Yes. That's his first time. So that was a good try. Excuse me. I just <laughs> fine. <laughs> There oh, we yeah. are. There, nice. Oh. You break it, you buy it, Colonel. <laughs> <laughs> so these are great for kids Absolutely. when you don't want to hand them a tablet these days, right? Absolutely. We have a wide range and great stocking stuffers or just things to entertain the kids. They're, they are really uh, entertained by the fact that, you know, they, they don't have anything to plug in right. or charge, so yeah. the kids really do enjoy it. Uh, three. Middle of the road. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> My. Wonderful. We, oh. And so we have different cannons, toy cannons, including one that's a pencil So these are ones that are good for kids. Yes, right? good for kids. <laughs> these are the ones we'll give to the kids. Much smaller than the artillery pieces <laughs> I'm familiar with, sir. So. And um, oh, there are tricorn hats. And this one, actually, I believe if you... Oh, you, you can, can actually bend make it. your own. Yes, you can bend it. It's a very nice... Now, of course, oh, perhaps... Yes, oh, oh you thank look you, so Colonel. Nice, nice. Yes. And you would, you would be a, a wonderful provincial in the, in the British <laughs> Very nice. Now, my favorite is the wool tricorn hat. So we have, oh, a, yes. we have three styles for... Depending on the child size or even adult. So... Um, Let's see these. The kids enjoy. This is almost as if the quartermaster's office has all these hats. <laughs> so a large variety, different styles, different. That one's very tiny. Oh, well, my head. I uh, excuse me. Oh, that's a bad. There, there you go. <laughs> very nice. Perfect soldier. Oh, my. Okay. We also have just good old-fashioned games like checkers. Nice. So families can come in and play checkers of course, while they're here. Of if you're here. to the king. We don't want to get too far with the king me's oh, and things okay. like that. <laughs> yes. Absolutely. Yes. Or you can queen me. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Madam, I believe you have very forward thinking. I am. I, am I can tell. Yes. yes, of course. So checkers, and it seems, oh, even we have Along with an armory. Game, we do. We carry bow, bow and arrows, um, historic sword. We have a saber. Very I do nice. not have mine with saber. me today. The kids still like... The musket. The musket, of course. course. You see this, the, uh, almost as if a it brown doesn't bass. It does shoot anything, but it's... But it does have the flintlock, yes, it, it seems, does. on here. Uh, but for children, this is something That's that I think That's perfect for children. Ah, yes. There we go. That's Very nice. That's training to be in the provincials. Absolutely. Yes, for training. And we've had visitors who have returned after 25 years of being here and say they got one when they were a kid and they still have theirs. Nice. Oh, Very yeah. nice. There are pistols in canteens. So here are some pistols. Ah, nice. Looks similar to, I believe you have two pistols around here somewhere. Is that yes, correct? Yes, we carry your pistols. Oh, mine. I wonder how you got those. <laughs> Authentic. And the colonel can explain what a powder horn is. Ah, of course, a powder horn. So this is where you would keep your gunpowder for your musket. Pour down in here to hold it, so that way when you need to fire your musket, you have the gunpowder to do so. Very nice. Also, we know that with the horn here, it's not going to go off in your powder Correct. horn. Correct. Very want any, important. Any 
very important. Absolutely keeps not. it dry, yes, right? Yes, it keeps it very dry. And who knows what they could use this for, the children, if they would want to. True. It, it's, we all are toys, <laughs> you know. Or with water, it is horn. It's so. good for the imagination. Yes, so. but I suggest if they just carry it, they look great. They right? Do look great. Yes. Absolutely. Thank you. Uh, you have a wonderful display. I do not want oh. to. Uh, <laughs> Thank I, it, you. It's all, Sutler's, it's all in the display. Absolutely. Now, with our games, we also have lots of family games that they can play. Ah. So, one popular game is similar to, it's called Captain's Mistress. Oh, madam. Yes. Let's, uh, <laughs> Captain's friend, perhaps. <laughs> well, it's called the Captain's Mistress because the captain of the pirate ship, or the ship uh, captain. Pirates. They may not be pirates. pirates. I've heard that there are pirates on the three rivers, madam. Near, the, near what you're calling Pittsburgh, is that correct? Yes, where Fortune came was. Yes, I hear they're not very good pirates. <laughs> is that true? No, they're very good pirates. Oh, they're very good. Oh, perhaps. Never mind. <laughs> <laughs> Be careful what you say around Pittsburgh, right? <laughs> <laughs> Come on. So, to... Um, ah, I just understand. Aha. That's the Connect Four of... Uh, of, the time of the time period. Well, you're taking both turns, so I never am. mind. Well, I am. Well, you're like, my person is the white ball and one is the brown. Ah, if you want to pull. There we go. Ah, and then they change. And then you can start again. Yes. So, and why is the game the captain's mistress? Because the captain would spend so much time in his quarters with his guests that the crew would consider it his mistress. Playing games. Yes. Playing, yes, games. playing games. Playing games. Playing games taking my turn. Instead of out there pirating now. things. There. Are you going to, is, is, this, is it common for me to let you win? Or? <laughs> I'm very competitive. <laughs> I see that. Now, we also carry playing cards of our current time period with a good looking uh, gentleman on the front. Yes. That looks very familiar. It does. And then there are 18th century playing cards. Uh, so they're, they are the cards they used to play with back then. They, okay. Uh, they do not have the numbers on them. They will just have, if it's six hearts, it's just six just hearts. Just the six of hearts. Mm -hmm. okay. And then there's a story behind it. A lot of our toys have a story and a history behind the products. Mm -hmm. uh, Great. So you have the history there, too. We do. And a lot of these games were tavern games. Okay. Ah. ah, the box that we must shut. Yes, shut the box. That is a small version. Ah, two and a three, perhaps. So I can either put down a five, correct, or the two and the three. Is that correct? That is correct. Ah, well, let's do five. That's a nice little travel version of our shut the box. I, I, there's lots of things here that while you I'm can traveling, take, I can absolutely. take with me. So, so it's great for plane rides or people from out of town to entertain the kids. I'm doing very well. I'm usually not this good, madam. And the goal is three and a t I've lost. The Put goal it back is up. to not <laughs> I can't get another one. down. Okay. And so that way you can then shut, shut, the, box. shut the box. Because see, whenever they're all up, you can't shut you the whole box. Yes, shut the box. You cannot shut the box. So we have the single version. We also have four player versions, which is a lot of fun. Ah. Very much so. Yes. Very nice. I love all these games. Let's get some puzzles. Oh, and the Royal Game of Goose. Royal Game of Goose is another tavern game. It is basically an adult version of Shoots and Ladders. Okay. So, yeah. so the board is a canvas oh, wow. board. Oh, wow. That was oh, shall I hold? Please, yes. thank you. I've, you might call me a, a model, perhaps. Yes, we could call you that. When an artist, you know, you need the model to sculpt. <laughs> yes, the thank That's you. That's right. And then there's a dice that they roll. There's directions, mm -hmm. but you would basically want to go spiral all the way around and the first ah. person to get to the 63. And everyone is a stone. And it is called the goose and look. Nice gemstones they in there. They are nice I like gemstones. That. A goose. Yes. There is a goose. There's a goose on the board. So <laughs> That's where the name comes from. <laughs> right on the nose there. Right on the nose. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Uh, you can just put it right You just want me to lay it out for yes, right now? Yes, I will put it away. It will tempt me from the other side of the room as I see it. Yes. Very enjoyable game. Now, as well as our games, we carry a wide selection of t-shirts and sweatshirts. We just got these uh, Fort Ligonier hoodies. Oh, I like these. Same. These are great for autumn, autumn coming. Regimental uniforms. Yes, we do have. Very nice. Keeps everyone warm. Fall's coming. So. Mm, it is. We coming also quickly, have I think. T-shirts. A wide variety of our t-shirts. This is a new arrival. The Fort Ligonier logo. 
Very nice. And Rosa said, well, never mind. That there was really good. Very nice. <laughs> there would be a nice small. one you might like. There is a famous quote from here. Ah, uh, that sounds like the quartermaster if I've ever heard it. This is yes. a most diabolical work, and whiskey must be had. That sounds like John St. Clair. Yes, it is. Ah, uh, yes. The and quartermaster and I, very special relationship. <laughs> <laughs> popular. We have it on glasses and... On whiskey right, glasses. On whiskey guess. glasses. And Who would have thought? Who would have thought? On a magnet. People nice. People love the whiskey quote. People love their whiskey. <laughs> I was going to say, madam, just in general. <laughs> in general. <laughs> it gets us through the day sometimes. Now, it does. let's continue. Oh, oh. Well, let me show you this real quick, since it's right here. Oh, you haven't... Oh. We have Excuse me, I thought it was a, a beef of animal. You, you <laughs> enjoy this. A little teddy bear. It has a candle It has in a little hand. flashlight on its paw. So nice. So are like, you know, afraid of the dark, they always have someone to go with them. So uh, it, the bears are very, That's nice very for popular. midnight okay, the bathroom okay, trips. Okay, the bear. The Look at this. <laughs> <laughs> my, my, you need to start writing me some of this, uh, the currency out yes, of the... Yes, we'll give you a... All the, the naming, <laughs> uh, some people I've heard say rice. Oh, yes. Okay, the bear. We'll give you copyright. <laughs> <laughs> oh my! So, oh, more literature. Right this way, yeah. So, um, the wide range of historical books about the time period. And these are mostly the fic non-fiction. Non-fiction. So a lot on George Washington. Hmm. As well as uh, Ligonier, as well. The history we have Ligonier two fifty. So it talks about. Um, Very the town, nice. The history of the town, about Fort Ligonier, and we try and keep books on uh, local items too. So Ligonier Valley, Ligonier Railroad, we have books on that as well in Idlewild. I did not know so many people wrote about this area. It, a lot has or myself. Here, sir. It's a very popular area, apparently. Yes, yes even I see that I'm saying goodbye in some of these. <laughs> yes. I didn't know I was on that, but I apparently have stayed my welcome. <laughs> <laughs> you are always welcome. I hope so. You're selling literature. That's what I should leave. <laughs> uh, what else do we have here? Ah, the local fur trader has stopped. Yes, those are rabbit pelts. Yes, how do they feel, though? Yes, yeah. They're very soft. Oh. Very soft, yes. See? I very can good. imagine. Very, very nice. soft. Oh, oh there no. There were multiple then. And, and the funny thing is some people buy them for their cats, too. I've had many visitors buy them as a souvenir. Very for luxurious cats. for yes. their cats. <laughs> it's a <layout. laughs> so, There's something for everyone at the gift shop at Fort Ligonier. Do you have cats, <laughs> Colonel Washington? They may be strays. <laughs> <laughs> and multiple dogs. And, uh, multiple large dogs, horses, of course. Oh, yes, yeah. <laughs> But I, the cats, I'm not, too, I'm not too sure about. Maybe in your barn. Perhaps. Perhaps. <laughs> we do carry a uh, Wendell August ornament of Fort Ligonier as well, and this is a popular item. Beautiful. For as a gift. Yeah, it is lovely. There we go. The light just right on those. Yeah. Very nice. And some more books up here. More books. We even have a book on the ghosts and legends of Fort Ligonier. Oh, very so, nice. And some of our staff members have, uh, are in the book as well. Oh, nice. Yeah. Some people experience things that go bump in the night. Oh, <laughs> interesting. I am not one of them. But <laughs> 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 well, with something as historical that's been around as long as this, there's bound to be something. Absolutely. There's always a story to be told, man. There is always a story There's to be told. There's always a story to be told, and usually you just hope it's a good one. <laughs> yes. <laughs> to be perfectly honest. It's true. No one wants bad stories. Exactly. No one wants a bad story. Well, step this way, gentlemen. Oh, right. my sweet tooth is just yeah. simply a little too much right now. So when visitors leave, a lot of them like to take a snack with them. Very popular is the old-timey candies. These are 20 cents each, and what people love... The candy sticks. We sell These thousands flavors. upon thousands in a year. Very and our blueberry, of course. Yes. Whorehound. This is an old flavor. It's from the mint family. It's basically a mint and licorice flavor. Very nice. And they used it back in uh, colonial times for sore throats. Oh. So, yes. I love licorice and mint. I may have to wow. try that. 20 nice. cents. Hey. Sore throats, can't beat perhaps. that, right? I find myself talking quite often. You Some people actually, say I talk too much. Some people might. 
<laughs> I, have a, I have a feeling that it's only the people here. <laughs> Again, here are some of our t-shirts, and we have a selection of ball caps. We have some more I'll show you uh, down the ways history a bit. happened. History happened. Well, I sure would hope so. <laughs> we have a needlepoint belt that can be special ordered. It has items from Fort Ligonier. Oh, um, isn't that nice? George Washington's pistols to, um, we have an apple that was pulled out of a stream when they were uh, doing an archeological dig. Oh, wow. And it was encased in the mud. Uh -huh. And so it was in perfect condition after oh, wow. 200 years. And then it started to deteriorate. That's amazing, quickly. of course, yes, yeah. amazing. So yes, this is a lovely uh, needle-pointed belt. It's you wonderful. may enjoy that. I, I'm just used to leather. No, uh, well. This, I'm not saying it that it's, it's, I'm I saying know. it's amazing. I'm used to But it's to good just... to mix it up a little bit, Colonel. Uh, <laughs> I might have to live by those words. <laughs> you, you've enlightened we, me so far. We may uh, see that in a book here soon, right? <laughs> <Who knows? laughs> Colonel so, Washington, again, here are it's good to mix magnets. it up. These are the Washington pistols. Oh, uh, the there's Washington that quartermaster. Pistols. Yes, <laughs> and there's the quartermaster's quote again. We also have a painting hanging in our... our uh, gallery called the Blaine print so he had done a sketch of Fort Ligonier. Oh okay. Oh, yeah. Archibald. Yes Archibald Blaine. Oh, he might have painted all of these. <laughs> <laughs> They're just copies. We have the original though. You make copies? You have artists to make copies? We do. My are they on, on your staff? <laughs> they are. We have by the staff. We hide them in the back, <laughs> right? <laughs> Toiling away. Wonderful, wonderful work. Now, going back to some of the games, we have things called like the Bilbo Catcher, which I am not very good at. Would you like me to give it a, a try? I would love that. Uh, <laughs> you can do it two ways. It's very difficult. Thank you. Let's see if it's because you have to land it on here. Um, oh. oh. So close. So, you know, as I continue this, we will be here for the next 45 minutes. Aha! <laughs> uh -huh. oh, wow, that's fantastic. I do not know oh, the appropriate right. celebration right now because it happens so really? infrequently. <laughs> but also, if you want to, the much more difficult is to try and get this like oh, that. Yeah. So, oh. as you can see, so here we go. No, not even close. And I did it. <laughs> nice. Sometimes you have Bravo. to find a different type of um, courage, we might say, <laughs> to finish things like this. Madam, thank you for Oh, you're welcome. Um, along the lines, here are some more of our toys for kids, as well as adults. So. Of course. I, you saw that I enjoyed playing with it. Absolutely. That is a little telescope. comes in a little wooden box, and it is compact. So Very you can take nice. it on your travels as well, Colonel. More traveling items. They're going to make me spend a fortune. I, I shall. Time pieces. Yes, we have pocket watch. It's always and important then for to the keep letter the time. writers. You are, sir. We have different calligraphy uh, quill and ink sets. So we have different varieties. You don't even have to make your own. You, that's it's right. right here. The fe feather included. <laughs> and fun fact that I learned from this calligraphy set, the uh, Supreme Court still uses uh, quill and ink. Oh, really? Yes, they do. It says it back here. Where's the exact fact? And now it probably, I won't even see it. <laughs> the U.S. Supreme Court you still uses 1,200 quills a year, upholding a tradition it began in 1801. So they still use the Very quill and ink. Nice. The future is a beautiful thing. It is a beautiful thing. <laughs> Apparently, yes. Oh, Many soothsayers. <laughs> and Colonel, you will need a striker kit. This the, is to build a fire. You know ah, yes, I do. Yes, of course. You have your flint and steel. The, you could show if you don't ah, mind, because yes, I'm not good at it. We have our piece of flint here. And actually, it seems that there is some char cloth actually oh. there that is created. Yes, it is. Uh, to make char cloth, which is um, to start the fire. And then there is actually a ah, striker here. So let us see. And of course, I have not needed to start a fire in quite some time. You have staff to do that. Oh. I yes. can hold that stuff. <laughs> Let us see, we have this piece of flint. Oh, wait, I saw one for I a moment. A I saw one for a moment. And this is why, oh, there it was. And this is why I take Christopher Gist with me, 
because I am not very good <laughs> at the making you of... You are better at the Bilbo catcher, sir. As okay. I break my piece. Well, of thank you. Excuse me. That's I fun. saw a brief spark. I did too. And all it takes is one spark. One spark. That's all you need. But right now, we're not going to have it. <laughs> we don't want a fire in the building. Also very true. This redoubt itself, I would rather not burn it to the ground. <laughs> oh, what are these? Oh, these are keychains, needle pointed keychains um, oh, for Fort Ligonier. So that's the flag of the time. 1758 is the year we began. And there might be another one with a soldier on it. He probably has sold out, but they are lovely. Oh, here he is. Oh, yes. There we the are. King's for colors. Coat. Very nice. Yes. And along with our games, we have things for quilts, you know, beginning quilt kits. We carry musket balls. Everyone enjoys that. Oh, my. You never know when you, you might need. Know. It is and always. And everything has a little story on the back, it so, tells you which all is about nice. It. Yeah, mm -hmm. so like a signal whistle, the whistle they would use to um, signal. So there's history with every. There's history with everything. I do enjoy greatly that the names are usually quite, <laughs> yeah. quite simple. Thank Very you. descriptive <laughs> names. Of yes. Course. Yes. I do also quite enjoy the whirly gig, you know, because it whirls and, and gigs. Of course, our little fish toss toy. <laughs> but uh, we have another, a large top here. Yes. Madam. You would pull the string. Cut. Should I? Should I try it? Sure, try it. Well. Pull it real hard. Let's see it. That's from local artist Matt Stein. Oh so yes. There it goes. I don't know if we got it. It might be a little dark. No, nope, we're yes, good. Going. We're good. I could watch that for hours. So it that it is doesn't seem like it will last, though. I'll try it again. No, but ah, uh, please continue, Madam. I will do this for you. Oh, of course. well, thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> um, and we have. Uh, Items like keychains and patches mm -hmm. and lanyards, so just a little something. And this is our, for your, <laughs> your beer cans or soda cans. Nice. Party like you just took Fort Duquesne with Fort Ligonier on the other side. Nice. So that's a lot of fun. And then um, we have water bottles. Come winter time, we have... Oh, that almost oh. looks familiar to, uh, it's, I believe, the, the Melisse of the French, where a, a similar, but it is red, but yes. did the same property, the idea of keeping the head warm. Yes, yes. it will keep your head warm. Oh, that's very nice. And then a variety of other hats as well, including this one has the Washi t-shirt. Oh, and it seems you might, are you having some sales there? On a couple of our hats, we are. Nice. Now, you've talked about um, Colonel Washington's pistols, and yeah. they are here, say, right? Yes. Yeah. We'll step over real quick okay. after this. Okay, very nice. Pocket watches, clay pipes. Um, they used to smoke from clay pipes back then. Oops, excuse me. And in, uh, if you go to, like, stagecoach, stops, things like that, they'd make them long, so then they could rip it off and another person could smoke off of them. Oh, wow. And you can still smoke off of these, too. And then we have silk ties and silk scarves that have the Washington pistols on them. And you saw the Christmas tied as a soldier with candy canes. <laughs> That's cute. Now, tell us a little bit about your hours when um, you're our open? Shop's open while the museum's open so that's monday through saturday 9 30 to 5 and then sunday it is 11 to 5. okay and that's year round it is um through november so okay. april through november in the winter we are open we're open friday saturday sunday and stockings that is i only, apologize <laughs> that would be 9 30 to 4. okay and then on sundays 11 to Great. And it's just the museum in the winter. Unfortunately, due to the weather, they can't be outside. Right. But it's still, it's very you cool. can shop and look at our galleries because there's plenty. Absolutely. Plenty Colonel, would you like to come see with our viewing audience the, the pistols? They these ones that are, I, I keep being told that, I, that, I, that they belong to you? Yeah, I've not seen these. All right. Well, well we can use a nice I, well, I'm going to continue because you have piqued my interest oh. about some of the items that are here. All right. So if you wanted to just give them, if you wanted to take a stroll into yeah. the redoubt, yes, you may do that while I you try look. and gather up some of my. You items. gather your items and then I will ring you up. Do you have cash? As a bell. Or credit? No. Perhaps you can put it on my credit. No, not credit. Credit card. I do. I'm not sending you anything for the holidays. You are not. Or perhaps a plastic. <laughs> 
How about you step over and I, I, I will meet you when you retire. Right, right this way. I'll show you all the uh, Washington pistol. So. Very nice. So then we have a gallery dedicated to George Washington. So these are his famous uh, saddle pistols. From the man himself. From the man himself. So that's what the emblem is throughout the museum, um, in the museum store. Beautiful. And if you come to the gift shop, you do not need to pay admission, but if you do come to the museum, you have to pay to see the gallery. Mm, of but course. You can shop anytime that we're open. Very nice. All right. Well, thank you so much for oh, joining thank us. Thank you so much. And we're so happy to do this, and hopefully, we can see you again soon. That would be great. All we're right. Going up the Absolutely. Right, thank, thank you. you. Thank you. Well, everyone, thank you for joining us today, and we hope that you've enjoyed it. If there's anything you've seen here that you'd like, we will um, help them get it to you. So until next time, thank you for watching this episode of Around the Town by Allegory Gallery. See you soon.